Hey there, my name is Gabe, I'm with API Nation. Today I'm gonna to show you how to connect your transaction zip form edition to Google Calendar so that all those important dates from your transaction are synced right to your phone. They're always with you. Let me show you. So here we are in transactions zip form edition. You can see I have a bunch of transactions here and each transaction has a variety of important dates here. Offer date, offer expiration date, date of contract, listing date, listing expiration date. And transactions actually has a great view of these in a calendar here. But like a lot of professionals, you probably run your date out of Google Calendar. And if that's the case, we can sync all this right to your Google Calendar. Let me show you how. We're gonna scroll on up here to the partners area, click on it, and then come on down here to Google Calendar. This sync takes all those important dates and gets them on your mobile phone and all the API Nation connections are so easy to set up. I'm just gonna click Connect Transactions. It's gonna ask me for my zip form username, password, and email, so I'm gonna add those. And then just click Connect. That sends me to step two, Connect Google Calendar. So I'm gonna click Connect Google Calendar, and it's just gonna ask me which Google account should we connect. I'm gonna use my professional Google account and hit Allow. Finally, just a few options to consider. Do I want to sync all of my dates on the first run? Absolutely. I want all the information I can in my Google Calendar. And now I can also filter by transaction status. So maybe there's too many dates getting sent to my Google Calendar. In that case, I only want to know about transactions that are active or pending. I don't necessarily want to know about all past, pre-listing, any of that stuff. I'm just going to leave it as active as pending. If you want to explore, just go ahead and start typing. You can see there's active, inactive, pending, prospect, fell through, closed. Yeah, I'm gonna just stick with active and pending. Seems like a smart way to set up my days. And finally, I can select a calendar to send all these dates to. I'm gonna go ahead and create a new calendar and I'm gonna call it Transactions. And I'm just gonna hit start. And there it is. We have our active workflow, our little employee, our robot. That's going through transactions at Form Edition and making sure all these dates are now synced to my calendar. Let's take a look. And there we go. Here we are in Google Calendar and all those important dates, along with the addresses and the locations, are already synced to my Google Calendar, ready to go. Not only that, if I set this up as an Office admin, I can go ahead and share this calendar with the rest of my team. Just scroll on down here to add people and then just add all the people that I work with to let them have access to this calendar and add it to their own Google Calendar as well. And this sync is always on, it's always working. So if an assistant or another agent or broker makes a change to an important date on your transaction, it'll be automatically sent to your phone and updated on your Google Calendar. You'll always know what's coming up and you'll never miss an appointment again. So we hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, ideas, comments, shoot us an email, give us a phone call. We're API Nation connecting the world's applications. We love doing this stuff.